This summit is so unique because that's the place where we're going to get to, together all the enablers of innovation. It is the place where right in the beginning from suppliers to clinical research organizations to regulatory bodies to uh, companies to investors that will get together in one single place for the betterment of uh, medical aesthetic injectables. So you should come because this event never happened. It's a very important uh, specific event with just one focus dedicated to the planet of injectables. The scientific committee, of course, that we have selected seems to be one of the key. We have everybody dealing with the high level of vulgarization concerning the most part of them, they are key opinion leaders with toxin and injectable from all over the world, the Asian, the United States people, and also all people from EMA, meaning Europe and Middle East and Northern Europe. The Aesthetic Injectable Summit brings together three different populations. The physicians, actually the key opinion leaders, in this field, together with scientists, people who actually do all the basic research on the field of injectables, both uh, botulinum toxin and fillers, and, the, and the, etc. And the third population is people who are with development of the product, starting from the raw materials to the technology, to the regulation, to the registration, to the financing, of and to the economy as well. Economy as well. So it is for the first time all these populations are brought together for more productive outcomes. So we have an exciting program uh, on day one. Day one will be focused on the neurotoxins. And what we have done here with this, uh, this summit, in essence, we are catering to the needs of each stakeholder, as Marina just talked about, all different demographics that will be attending this conference. On day one, we'll be starting with basic science. And then after that, we'll go into product analysis. We'll be talking about the innovation, disruptive innovation happening in our sector. Uh, then we'll move on to do a competitive landscape, looking at what's happening across uh, different uh, companies and in what's coming out of from the startup scene as well, too. And then lastly, we'll have some debates on some hot topics, some controversial topics that industry is facing, which will include a fireside chat, and in the end, we will close off by an award ceremony as well, too. So, day two uh, will be absolutely on the same standard as day one, but just for the filler, a focus on HA, non-HA, all tools, all services like artificial intelligence and genotherapy medicine dedicated to the injectable. So, we begin by the scientists, people like Fawad, you select big people like you, Marina, dedicated to the creation, the creation of the product. Then we go to the CMO, Chief Medical Officer, we are going to be on the product analysis session. Then we go to the startup. So please, all startup, we are in this world, you need to be there. You will see what's the podium. Then we go to the CEO. And the CEO, of course, will debate with the economic analyst like BCG. And they will be, of course, on this analyze, quantitative and qualitative of the market. Then we go to what coming and what coming on 24, 25. So it's not the startup that what is ready to arrive on the market. And then we go to the battle. What's the battle? Battle is the unique opportunity for physicians. But just for physicians. Physicians, company leaders. Company will be out. Yes. And then we gather together to come from controversies to consensus. And it's going to be a long way. And we are going to discuss very specific and urgent issues in our field. And our target is to come into consensus and then to publish it, right? We are going to publish and it we in a specific journal. We already know where. We are going to tell you what's the top, top index factor Plastic Surgery Journal, which is going to support all articles from this consensus. That's fantastic. That's not so bad. What do you think? Very, very right? good. I am delighted. And that's what it makes it so unique. Yeah. We are going to have people from the early stage on, on APIs, the active materials. We're going to have contract manufacturers. We're going to have 
CROs, we're going to have something that is very, very unique, and that will create kind of an ecosystem that will be the beginning of everything for the future of Injecto. It's not finished. Yeah, but we have the debate. The beginning. We have the debate. So the debate about what? First, day one will be dedicated to all problems in front of the Commission, FDA, CE, the Asian, the Chinese, of course. Right. And day two will be what is totally green, but gray, meaning that, that we have the gray market, we have the entrance of uh, the non-doctor in our profession and many, many sociological and economical problems to debate. So you are a leader, you need to be in. And this is the only Congress that at the end of each, we are going to have some outcome for each and every one of att the attendees. You can come with the consensus, you can come with the connection between you who have has an idea in looking how to develop his idea, and for you who has an idea, know how to develop it, but needs some financial help and maybe some regulatory assistance, right? So this is the only Congress that you get and then a full outcome that you can appreciate. What we have to put on the table now is crucial. Never exists in our profession before. The platform for the speed matching activity. So what is speed matching? Speed matching to me... In, in this case, right? In this case. Not in general. Not in general, exactly, exactly. Uh, it's basically, it's the most innovation comes from our physicians, in essence, right? And physicians are always the ones who have ideas about where can I make some efficiency? Where can I go after new uh, treatments for my patients? And new this, indications. New indications as well, too. And in this forum, we'll have resources available to them, whether it's entrepreneurs, whether it's the consulting groups as well, whether it's big companies who are looking for new ideas as well, too. And these physicians, as my colleagues talked about, will have an opportunity to share their ideas and hopefully take it to the next But level. that platform, it's actually to tool. Yes. To schedule the, the meeting during the Congress. Of course. So you need to go there to check who you want to meet with, yes. to register, and, and in will, Marbella. And you will have the rendezvous. Of course, Mar Marbella, are. October 4th to 5th, you are able to, to have this rendezvous. If, especially the physicians, if you are entrepreneurial, if you have innovations, this is a place to come. Thanks. Absolutely. I mean, this is one unique forum where it's not just for startups, for big strategics, right? This is a forum that, in, in, especially in my years being in the industry, that you haven't seen the, the diversity of the topics and opportunity to engage with the different stakeholders. If you are a leader in the field of injectables, be in Marbella.